Okay, this is a basic video of uh, my Nesolestrin C8. Now, here's the thing. The reason for this video is I'm going to show you a shortcut how to get a much wider view without spending too much money at all. Literally spending a hundred bucks more for a much wider field of view without attaching it to this end and this end and the other end and every end. So, let's take a look what I got here. I got a, uh, a seven point whatever. It's a Celestron reducer. Okay. It reduces about, I'll give it a 20% or, or so. 20% um, um, wider view. I don't th that's what it does. 25%. Not sure. I'm going to give it, do your own mathematical calculation. Now, I'm going to show you something here. First, let's take a look how it looks like with a regular reducer with one reducer. Okay? Because we are going to attach, guess what? <laughs> Another reducer. Just attach it on top. We'll see in a second. First, let's turn this on. Okay, this is what we see. You see what I see here? I see, uh, I see, I see, 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 okay, good. Now, without the reducer, you can imagine that it's going to be, what, zoomed in more by this much, you son of a gun. Oh, it's, it, it, this is a touch screen, I forgot. Okay, M imagine that this, this object here is wider, it's zoomed in more, okay, by 20%. Okay, good, good enough. Right, uh, pause. Now, I have this this reducer and the other reducer attached. So I'm not sure. It could work without a Celestron reducer, the basic reducer that looks like this, the ring with the green. Oh, son of a gun. With the green, you see? I just attached it now. And now I'm going to attach it to directly to the back. Okay. I'm not going to do it. Hold on. I'm going to wait. I'm going to, break, I'm going to pause for this to, to screw it on. Hold on. Son of a gun. Continuation without getting eaten up by mosquitoes. Because I have mosquitoes in my backyard. Now, this is re attached. <clears throat> you see, the, I put the, this reducer and this. There's two reducers times two attached. And it's going to be times three wider for some reason. Watch what happens. Okay, I'm going to turn this on. Okay. Whoa! We're confused. Wow, wow, what, what, what happened? I'll show you. We're going to refocus it. Okay. One second, I have to refocus it the other way. You silly man. Uh-oh. My parrots are breaking something. Refocusing the other way until we get my object in there oh yeah it's going where are we going all right oh i know it's focused it's sharp now oh hold on now it's sharp but it's so it, it, it has completely disappeared almost the object look at that look how much more space it's sharp, it's sharp, guaranteed sharp, because my, my camera is not doing what it needs to do. Okay, you saw what I need, you needed to see. That is unbelievable, because now I'm going to get anything I want. The Horsehead Nebula with the C8. There's a few other objects, I'm telling you. you this is unbelievable. It, no one does, I don't think anyone has posted this. I looked on, on the YouTube, no one posted anything like this. Two reducers, you get a, like three times more of a... Right off the bat, three times the the the, the width. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm so rough. Four minute video. Hope you didn't, I didn't waste your time, and I hope I saved you a lot of money. Oh yeah, I am very excited about this. I can't wait to be out at night to try this. It's because it works perfect. Yippee!